Hey, 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 welcome to our channel, T-Girl Magic Tarot. Here to do a reading for my J -J Gemini, my Geminis. What is going on, Gemini? What's going on, family? Returning visitors, cross watchers, new subscribers, everyone here is welcome. Thank you so very much for joining me. Thank you guys for literally seriously all of your likes your shares your subscriptions your comments your donations your emails just everything jim and i and if i don't respond to your emails i am super extremely busy i do see them it'll take me maybe a few days no less than a week um but i am open for reading so i do check them daily um so i'll try to get back to everybody as soon as i can okay you guys be patient with us sister but anyways, the general message is not going to resonate with each and every cross watcher, Gemini, high vibe, low vibe, whoever. It may not resonate with anybody. So just take those messages that resonate and leave the rest. Don't try to force anything to fit. Choir, come to the front. Come to the front. One, two, three. Oh, T-girl, tarot, magic and collective. T-girl, 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 magic and collective. T-girl, Tarot, magic, and collective. Come check us out and see what we're about. Mm. We are Gemini, 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 Gemini. We sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. We are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Yay! Give the choir a round of applause. You guys do such a good job in raising these vibrations. Okay, you do. I love you so much. Sending you an abundance of love, light, and healing vibes. Spirit, let's get an um, energy read for what, what, what the energy is overall surrounding in Gemini's reading, Spirit. What is the overall energy in Gemini's reading that is what you're going to be covering? Okay, thank you, Spirit. Thank you. Did y'all tell the Holy Spirit thank you today? I think you should tell the Holy Spirit thank you. We talk, okay, the overall energy is, okay, maybe action, okay? Somebody's forward movement, okay, action taking, and then we got the five, okay. Damn, Gina. Somebody's going through a dark night of the soul, okay? They're having a transformation. So somebody is stepping up to the plate. Uh, Gemini, there's a uh, fire sign or somebody in this uh, fire king of wands energy. A Sagittarius, Leo, or an Ergy, but uh, Ergy. <laughs> uh, king of wands energy, Sagittarius energy. Okay, they've made a judgment call. Or they're under judgment right now, okay, about some, some type of truth or some type of clarity. But somebody's just stressed out and in despair right now. They can't sleep at night because they're feeling left out in the cold or they're facing some type of poverty. But someone is going through the dark night of, a, of the soul. Okay, somebody's going through a transformation. They're going within this King of Wands energy. And so by this is happening because they're, they're being forced to step up to the plate because this person is under judgment, okay? So, yeah, the overall energy is somebody's under judgment. They're being forced to change. I'm hearing Michael Jackson. I'm going to make a change for the rest of my life. So, they used to be a king of wands, and now they're trying to be the emperor. All four kings combined, because that's what the emperor is. This is an older person, okay? So, they are, they are in their, they are of age. Um, An older father figure, okay? This person possibly, you know, they run empires. They're a businessman. Was this King of Wands a businessman or are they just a gigolo? I need to know. What's going on, Spirit, for my babies? What is this King of Wands? What is this Emperor and the King of Wands energy is representing? Because. Mm. This person, low key, hold on. They're represented an emperor because they're already a family situation. They are already a father figure. This person does drink a lot. They're very smug, very selfish. So they're being forced. So this is an emperor energy because they like to exercise their control. They like to over manipulate their control. 
because they are very arrogant and they do a lot of shit without thinking, okay? They like to speak out of turn, very sharp with their tongue, very aggressive energy. Yeah, very petty, petty betty energy, okay? This person's feeling defeated and this person's willing to win at all costs. This is the type of person that's, this is the person that's going through this, this transformation. Mm-hmm. They're like, what have I done? This person's like feeling like, what have I done? Now they're facing some type of loss because they're under judgment right now. Because I'm peeling up this God and showed it. He, he, he stepped in like, first of all, I'm going to need you to calm down. Okay? Because you too, you too hot to trot. What else, spirit? What is this five of uh, pentacles for this? What's the five of pentacles energy? Oh, they feeling left out in the cold because you're single, sexy, abundant, self-sufficient, doing your thing. You went within. You had a transformation. And now you stepped into your emperor energy and now you're receiving the nine of cups. Okay? And you're being celebrated. There's forward movement towards you. And now this person want to come and cuss you out because they mad because you healing. Ain't that some shit? And shit is moving slow for them. Okay? They want to come in all slow and make a solid offer. But I don't feel this person is solid for you, babies. Um, yeah, they got, still got other lovers. They could be another Gemini such as yourself, but they don't have to be. But this person does. They can, But they put you in a competition. They had a choice between two. They chose wrong. And now, yeah, they want your forgiveness. Yeah. What else, Holy Spirit? Why is the Nine of Swords here with this? Why is this person so stressed out about Gemini's transformation? They depressed about your transformation, child. They don't like... Ooh, they are toxic. Number one, this person is so petty, so envious, so low vibrational, so like they like the spotlight on them. This person could have a lot of friends. They could be very popular in their community or, you know, they have a lot of friends that, you know, they can they drink with or celebrate with or whatever the case may be. This person is depressed because you have stepped into your power. And you're celebrated and you're being celebrated and you are your own wish fulfillment in your nine of cups. And this person's mad and sad because they're so toxic. They have, they have a lot of toxic ways and bad habits, a lot of addictions. This person likes to have one night stands and flings all over the place. Yeah, that builds their ego. That makes this person feel good. If they're not having a one night stand or somebody ain't on their jock or their nut sack or, or their titty... <laughs> This person is not happy. They're not. So you left them. So you said, okay, well, go ahead. Be where you want to be. And um, now they want to come back and say, I'm sorry. The past wants to come back and apologize to you, Gemini. But you already went through a transformation. And they're feeling defeated. Because now that's why they're, they're mad. Because they know you don't, you've don't. you ended things with this person. And you've already made the judgment call to leave this person out in the cold. And they're mad about it, okay? So they're coming, charging in. What is this seven nights? What, what's going on? Why are they charging in so damn? Why are they charging in like they are? Gemini ain't going to take that shit. I don't feel the Gemini because they really want a family with you, but that's not going to get Gemini because they in balance. Gemini, this is an opportunity that's been missed, I feel, okay? Now they want to take action. That's the that's the, the overall reading of uh, uh, energy of the reading is they want to take action and move forward to this nine of cups and step into this emperor energy. They missed the boat. Judgment's already been called on this person. If they weren't so in their ego and in their penis sack or their nut sack or their titty sack or whatever they at, they wouldn't be, you know, feeling defeated or in regret or some type of depression. But they want to come rushing, charging, Trying to one-up or feel... I don't know what the hell. But they want a family with you. Because they're mentally, physically, emotionally, and financially imbalanced. Okay? That's why they want to come in. And they want to come and heal things. And, and ask for your forgiveness. They want to start off slow. Of course they want to start off slow. Because they don't have shit. Because that's why they come in as the wounded warrior. Going to try to dump off on you all. They hard it. They hard ships. And what they've gone through. You know, yeah, woe is me, here we go. Yeah, this is a risk taker. They're going to 
They're going to trauma bond you because they took the wrong risk. They went down the wrong way. They didn't listen to their intuition. And now they feel feeling foolish. And now they want to... Now they want to manifest a brand new beginning of, I'm sorry, let's start it all over again with you. And I want to be up front and start a new beginning. Now they want to show up as the king of swords. Boy, goodbye. Or girl, goodbye. And give a family situation. When they had a chance to have a family situation, but they juggled that shit. They left you. You don't want shit. Yeah, they left you. They left you. You don't want that shit. They left you when you guys were supposed to be building a family together. They ended up causing extra conflict and chaos. They ended up cutting you out and taking the leap of faith somewhere else, being a risk taker. What is this? Yeah, now they want to offer this shit to you. The King of Swords energy. So it could be another air sign operating in this King of Wands energy. That's an old ass person who drinks too much, is always doesn't take accountability or responsibility for the moves that they make. They're having a woe is me, you know, poor little me. But this is all because of the actions that they took of their toxic ways. That's why. They don't have any self-control. They don't have their solar plex chakra, their root chakra, and their sacral chakra is dead. Okay? Well, the root chakra is over, uh, over, it's, um, overactive, spirit's telling me. Yeah, their root chakra is overactive. Okay? Um, there's, it, it, they need to tone it down. Okay? They are, this person's always mistaking lust for love because they don't really understand lust or love, the difference between the two. They need to heal still. This person is too low vibrational. They need to go seek the Heavenly Father. They need to seek God. They need to elevate. They need a child. They need a whole lot. Spirits, they need to be built from the ground up. Damn. What else, spirit, for my Janice? Yeah, this cycle's over. This cycle is over. Completely over. Yeah, you're blocking it. You're block you don't want to open it. You don't want to you don't want to collect 200. You don't want to pass go. You just want to get you just want to build your cities and just collect all the money and just play monopoly and not go to jail. That's all you want to do. But this person, look, they said because they really want this. And this is why they're heartbroken. Because this person's never going to be able to get between your legs or hop on the wand or stick or whatever they were able, were able to do before. They know that they're not going to be able to do that ever again with you. And this sickens them because you laid everything to rest with this person, um, Gemini. Yep, you did. And some of y'all got into a higher level of commitment or getting new. Congratulations for those of you who got just got engaged. Congratulations for those of you who are getting ready to get engaged. Some of you don't even know you're about to be married. You sure don't. And spirits say that's the truth. Because it's going to happen so quick. But it's something that you've been working and manifesting without you even knowing it. And this King of Wands energy is your counterpart. So this is a whole other different energy as well. That you're going to have a Ten of Cups with. Because you close out a cycle with this toxic ass, foolish, chaotic energy. Low, vibrating, needing, healing, arrogant, look at me. Older person, child. Mm-hmm. What else, Holy Spirit? How is on this person's um, headspace for my Gemini's? What are they thinking about? What's in their headspace? Oh, communicating to you, the marriage. Communicating to you, I want to put in teamwork and collaboration. Communicating to you the truth of how they feel about you. Mm, I wouldn't even trust that. Actions speak louder than words. This person showed you by keeping you in competition and closing out cycles. And being cold and detached. Yeah, but they want to communicate to the empress. They want to communicate that they want to work with you. They want to work with you. Put in teamwork and help build with you. But you do doing fine on your own at the end of the day. Okay? Yeah, they want to start anew. But, honey, they're, they're heavily burdened. They can't. This is heavily burdening to them. Why is this heavily burdening to them, spirit? Because they, I mean, I'm just confused. Why? I don't, I don't like that. Why are they confused? Because you're the queen of pentacles and they all in their head because they missed the fucking boat. Yep, look. I can't make it up. They walked away from the fucking ace and backstabbed and betrayed them damn selves. Look, because you're the queen of pentacles because they've imprisoned themselves mentally. Okay, they didn't know you was going to be the one. You was going to be so successful, single, and a fucking abundant. Look at all your solar plex, sacral, and root chakras so completely balanced. And this is your justice. 
And these dumbasses walked away. That's why it's a heavy burden. They walked away from the ace, which is you, Gemini, okay? So what is in this person's heart space? What's in their head space is they want to come and message you because they fucked up. But they can't. What's in their heart space? The Queen of Cups, they have a lot of love for you. They have a, they're very emotional for you right now. But I don't feel... Tell me about this devil energy. Gemini, trust it? I don't feel that they should trust this spirit. I don't... No, they're a page. It's, it's, they're small, yeah. This is an older person that still has growing to do. They haven't developed all the way. They could have mental problems. They could have a... um, Yeah, the spirits say reject it. They have... They have mental problems as far as growth. This is very, this is a very immature person. Um, they look mature. They look like they should have some sense and know better. But the way this person moves, I'm hearing they're very obnoxious, very arrogant. They think they know everything. They're very cold, detached, cutting, sharp with their words. They uh, could be borderline alcoholic, definitely a sexaholic. Uh, this person is an opportunist and they use people, okay? For their benefit but they always want to man emotionally manipulate you with this you know, so when they have sex with you then they want to pour all their love like i love you or let's do yeah this person's weird i don't know they're they they turn hot and cold they flip like they say flop flip and flop and flop look they wish washy this person wish washy one day they like a sour patch kid first they sour then they ask is a sweet child mm -mm. And so you made a judgment call because this person kept you. They left you. Yeah, you cut them out because this person kept, and you killed the whole situation because this person kept you in your head. Sometimes they would, you had anxious and, you know, you couldn't sleep and you had panic attacks because this person's energy is so negative. But this child want to come to you. This child want to come and offer mama an apology. Or maybe your child wants to offer you an apology for if, if, if it's a child, Okay. Some of y'all had to leave your kids out in the cold to show them. It's a grown child for some of y'all, okay? Now this, now he's going to come back. Don't let him trick you because some of y'all look at this person as a little kid. So when this grown person, your grown child comes to you, you automatically look at them as, as a small child, okay? And then they're able to manipulate you so then you all get all in your head or something. Get out of your motherfucking head because you're going to end up leaving yourself out in the cold, okay? This is a grown-ass man. Whoever this is or a grown-ass woman that's responsible for themselves and they can take responsibility. They're the ones who can take control and they have power over their life. But they need to balance it out and it's not through you. No, they... Oh, yeah, yeah. This person's being forced. Yeah. Yeah. They mad because they don't have no money. They holding on to everything. Their whole life seems like an illusion. They having sex, offering every... Yeah, they... This is... This, this, ooh. This person is low-key, lying, prostituting, having sex, love-bombing people for money. Mm. And they're going to try to come straight to you. Oh, hell no. Talking about I've been working hard. I've been working hard. Oh, hell no. Mm -mm -mm. I've, been, I've been working on me. Let's balance out the scales together because you my two of cups. I've been waiting. Mm -mm. No. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No, Gemini, free yourself, okay, babies? Free yourself, for sure. Because you're going to end up here if you if you end up here with them. If you go here and do some committing with this person or whatever the case may be, you're going to end up in the fucking five of pentacles, okay? And I'm going to tell you, for some of y'all that are having a wedding this weekend, some homeless people are going to try to crash it, okay? I'm just going to tell you that right now. They're going to try. They gonna try, I said try to crash it because I don't think you're going to let them do that to you, Okay? But anyway, Gemini, that's been your reading. I hope this has helped. Um, until next time, I love you guys so much. Bye.